Yo, what up? Good morning, everybody. So, do you guys know that my Google Pixel 8a is currently on Evolution X 9.4, but it's been giving me a little bit of issues lately. Um, so, in this video, you guys are going to see me revert this back to stock Android. So, literally, what you're going to do is go to this site right here. Um, it's the Android Flash tool. And so, you guys can see that I picked basically Android 14. It is um, a uh, stable build. And I went ahead and chose to not only wipe the device and flash uh, the stock Android 14, but also to relock the bootloader. And no matter what issues there is, it's gonna force flash it on. So that way, you know, cause it was on a stock, not a stock, but a custom ROM. So this is how you do it. As you can see, it's, it's uh, downloading the software. It's about 2.8 gigs. Um, and then it will flash it onto the device and relock the bootloader. And relocking the bootloader because tap to pay. Got it, you know. Once you unlock the bootloader, tap to pay fails. So just keep that in mind. So anyways, I'll check back in once everything is done here. And if I run into any issues, I'll explain what the issues were and what I had to do to fix it. And on the, on the side note, um, yes, this is my Pixel book. So it is technically a Chromebook, it's not a Windows PC. Just for those out there, I mean, it's preferred to use Windows or Mac, but you can use a Chromebook if that's all you have. Um, and there's no uh, drivers that need to be installed or anything like that from the jump. So yeah, just keep that in mind, little side note. So as you guys can see, it's flashing everything in updating the super partition it's already reinstalled the bootloader it's rebooted several times uh, now it's uh, flashing all the necessary uh, system images so almost done uh, once it's doing all this it will then relock the bootloader so that'll be like the last step is relocking down the bootloader and then uh, we should be good from there. But um, I'll be back once everything's done and the phone's rebooted. All right, so it's pretty much done. Um, so now on the device, it would say, do not lock bootloader. You wanna use the volume rockers to toggle where you want to lock the bootloader and then press the power button for confirming. And that should be it. Now, as you can see, it says status locked. So now we're going to start the device and make sure that everything is good. And for the magic of editing, I'm going to skip. And here we are. We are back at the setup screen. So, yeah, that's it. It's pretty much how to get your pixel device back to stock rom if you guys have any questions comments concerns emotional outbursts ask them drop a comment and i'll respond um yeah till then we'll get my pixel 8a set up back on stock rom